Paano ba ang pumayat ng mabilis? Today, I will be sharing you a unique dietary strategy to lose weight but still maintaining a healthy body. Presenting to you Japanese Banana Diet, also called as Morning Banana Diet. According to Wikipedia, Free Encyclopedia, Morning Banana Diet was popular in Japan in year 2008. Created by Osaka pharmacist Sumiko Watanabe for her husband Hitoshi Watanabe who lost 17 kilograms in weight. So dun siya nagsimula. So take note, this dietary plan is very simple, madali lang siya, at hindi magastos. So ano ba ang ginagawa nitong Japanese morning banana diet? or Japan's most popular diet for weight loss. So, ito na ang meal plan. Number one, eat banana for breakfast. Therefore, saging lang yung kakainin mo sa umaga. So, instead na kumain tayo ng tapsilog, hotdog, bacon, at iba pang instant na pagkain sa umaga, saging lang yung kakainin mo. Pwede isa, dalawa, tatlo, apat na saging with warm water lang. So, yun lang ang breakfast niya. Medyo tipid po ba? Pwede rin naman na three bananas and an apple. So, you can combine it. Maganda talaga yung pruta sa umaga. Number two, eat normally for lunch and dinner. So again, yung lunch and dinner are normal. So hindi ka pa rin magpapagutom. Pwede ka pa rin kumain ng kanin during lunch and dinner. But in Japanese style, for their lunch, no dessert. Doon tayo talo. Doon tayo magkaiba. Dahil dito sa Pilipinas, we love yummy and sweet desserts. Like halo-halo, kakanin, macaroni salad, at iba pa. Yung mga matatamis, syempre yun ang nakakataba. Again, yung Japanese diet, no dessert. Walang matamis, tubig lang. Number three, drink water only or green tea. As I have said a while ago, walang soft drinks, no sweetened juices, no iced tea. Pwede kang mag-only water, pwede kang mag-only green tea. Yun lang. Kailan ka pwedeng kumain ng matamis? That's number four. Afternoon snacks. You can eat sweets during your afternoon snacks. But in moderation. Doon ka lang allowed kumain ng sweets. Pwede kang kumain ng kapirasong chocolate. Yun lang in moderation. Number five. Chew more and eat mindfully. Dapat kung kumakain, dahan-dahan lang. Eat mindfully. Relax. Japanese style, dapat nguyaing mabuti ang kinakain. Number six, stop eating when 80% full. Pag may laman na ang tiyan, medyo busog ka na, stop eating na. Bawal yung busog na busog ka na hindi ka na makahinga. Pag naramdaman mo na na 80% busog ka na, tigil na. Number seven, early to bed. Last meal should be 8 o'clock in the evening. Pero kung kaya mo, pwede yung 6 o'clock. Pero no meal beyond 8 p.m. Number 8, exercise without being stressed. Pwede kang mag-exercise, pero huwag magpaka-stress habang nag-e-exercise. Okay, so those are all the 8 dietary plan of Japanese banana diet. So let us now review all the 8 meal plan. Number one, eat bananas for breakfast with warm water only. Number two, eat normally for lunch and dinner but without desserts. Number three, drink water only or green tea. Number four, you can eat sweets during afternoon snacks but in moderation. Number five, chew more and eat mindfully. Number six, stop eating when 80% full. Number seven, early to bed. Last meal should be 8 o'clock in the evening. And number eight, exercise without being stressed. Okay guys and gals, so depende na rin yun sa inyo if you're going to follow this strategy. But for me and to some of my friends, this strategy really works. Basta porsigido lang po kayo sa inyong health goals at idagdag natin yung disiplina sa ating food intake and losing weight will always be possible. 
Also, add water consumption. 8 to 12 glasses of water a day. Especially when you're hungry, drink water instead. But still, it depends upon your body condition because you, you are the ones who knows your nature of work and your body condition. Then during snacks, most preferably, eat bananas or other kinds of fruits instead of eating cakes, kakanin, sweetened beverages, milk, tea, soft drinks, kasi yun ang nakakataba, yung mga matatamis. Of course, prefer eating fruits and vegetables. Yun ang pampahaba ng buhay. Gaganda tayo, papaya tayo, malayo tayo sa sakit. Proven and tested po talaga yung fruits and vegetables. And among these wonder fruits is banana. So, ano ba ang meron sa saging? Bakit well-recommended siya for breakfast and snacks and effective for weight loss? Okay, so here are some of the health benefits of banana. Number one, bananas has vitamin C, B6 with manganese, and of course, high in potassium. Number two, bananas could lose weight kasi nakakabusog siya. And very convenient to bring inside a bag, inside a car, beside your bed. So if you eat banana, you will no longer be craving for heavy and healthy snacks. Bananas give you energy. That is why most of the players eat this during snacks because it increases energy level. Number three, banana is zero cholesterol, no fat, no sodium, and high in fiber. So, mas makakatulong siya for digestion. Good for the stomach because it prevents us from constipation. Number four, you may fall asleep faster. Bananas has tryptophan, which our body converts it into serotonin that will make you feel happy and relaxed. Number five, good for the heart because it has high potassium. Number six, Good for persons with diabetes because it has low glycemic index. Number 7, full of antioxidants. O ba ang galing-galing? Mura na, healthy pa. And the most important is that it will help us on our goal for weight loss. But remember, never overconsume bananas for overeating bananas could also reverse all the benefits that bananas may have to offer. Kasi kung marami yung kinakain mong kanin, ulam, at dessert, tapos overconsumption ka pa sa saging, so hindi na rin yun maganda. Masama na yun. So remember that too much is always bad. I guess that ends our video for our health tips today. So if you find this video helpful, please consider giving this a big thumbs up. Like and share this video to your friends. And also subscribe my channel for more health tips. Once again, that's all for today. Always smile and God bless everyone. See you next time.